Lawyers are back in a Louisville courtroom today for round two in a lawsuit over Kentucky's abortion bans. Right now, two abortion laws are on hold with a temporary restraining order. But Planned Parenthood and the ACLU of Kentucky want a more permanent court order. And the Attorney General's office wants the abortion ban to be the law of the land. LEX 18's political reporter Carolina Buchek joins us now with today's big story at noon. Kentucky's abortion ban was in effect for less than a week before a state court blocked it with a restraining order. But that order, it is not a permanent thing. So depending on what happens in court, Kentucky's abortion ban will either be put back into effect and abortion will stop or abortion will be allowed to continue. Of course, the attorney general's office wants that ban back in place. They are arguing that the Supreme Court of the United States gave each state the power to make its own abortion decision, and Kentucky has chosen to ban abortion. But the ACLU of Kentucky, which is representing abortion providers, is arguing that the state constitution protects abortion rights, so the state can't ban the procedure. So they're hoping the court will issue an injunction which blocks the ban. Now, since this is an argument about constitutionality, legal experts believe this issue will ultimately go all the way up to the Kentucky Supreme Court. But even if the high court strikes down the ban, abortion is on the ballot in November. Voters will be asked whether or not they want to put anti-abortion language into the state constitution. If voters say yes, Kentucky's constitution will be changed to make it very clear that abortion is not allowed in the state. So ultimately, this decision is really up to the people of Kentucky. In Louisville, Carolina Buchuk, Elite 18 News.